Hello, everyone. I have some boxes. You want to open them with me? So. Oh. All right. So here we have the Darth Maul lightsabers. These are the legacy lightsabers from Disney. And this is them. As of right now, this is the complete Darth Maul, Darth Maul set. All right, um, I guess I should show you. So these two are his lightsabers. I mean, this is two. This is the new one that came out like just now. <laughs> All right, so we have his lightsaber. Right there. Oh, they closed on itself. Lila has the force powers. Can't you hear her? <laughs> Alright, so these both are the mall sabers. Um they retail for like 150 bucks or so. This um, new one that just came out, the one that's underneath, this one retailed for like 150, 170-ish. Oh. Disney's gonna up their prices, so don't quote me on their prices. But here's the malls. So we didn't just buy these. We had their malls for a while. Long time. Pretty cool. This is what it look like. Bam. You have your emitter up here. Comes with a little thing so you don't like put your finger inside. Yeah. Then you have your on and off switch. Very inconvenient right here. You couldn't like make it a button. You had to make it like a turning knob. All of these do not do anything. They're just for show. Yeah. And it comes with a whole bunch of stickers on it that you can peel and then get the glue off. But we keep our stickers on because that's what we do. So there's that. Just going to place it right here so it can pop. And here's our other one. Right here with the little like, don't put your finger in this hole. Tidbit. And then if you want, you can remove this thing inside. Well, I mean, you should, but other savers, you, you can remove it. Inside, you have your connector piece right here. Uh, and your Allen ring. It was right here, right next to it. You're gonna need these things in order to shove them together. Put this all back. Oh. I love their boxes for the lightsabers. I wish they made them a little bit better quality. Like, I would be willing to pay a little bit more if they made them better quality. Like, I love the box. I wish they were a little bit more sturdier. And then like, like, come on. So I'm like, I just opened it. Like just, it's just a piece of fabric. It's plastic. Like that's all this is. Ooh, so fancy. Come on. I appreciate it, Disney. But us as collectors, we can we can pay a little bit more for the finer things, you know. 
and I shove it back in here. There it goes. All right, put boxes off to the side. These come together, they make a baby. You know, you know Star Wars stuff. You have your connector, you have your Allen wrench. So in order to make them line up, you need to unscrew, or not unscrew, but like, um, I don't want to do it, but there's a nut right here. You gotta unscrew it just a little bit so you can move these rotating pieces so that you can have these line up perfectly if you care. If you care, it's possible. If you don't care, eh, then it's fine. So, on the bottom, you have your little battery thing. Unscrew it. Here's your your batteries. Just uh, put that in there. That's really scratched in there. Can you see that? Can you see how scratched it is in there? Disney, you need to do a better job on finishing your product. Your metal rebar. So you got that. Then you just screw it in. Bam! You have your lightsaber. Do we do this? No! We loop it. I know. You guys come here for the great content and the dog whining in the background. So we have. And me dropping stuff. So we have our two backs, or two butts, or whatever you want to call them. I'm just going to build it like this. So, see how mine's already lined up? Well, it's not lined up perfectly. There we go. Almost perfect. But there it is. This is Darth Maul's lightsaber. Okay, bye. No, not really. We still gotta open this guy. All right. So we gotta turn this guy on. So he has things coming out the side of his. Are you ready to hear Lilu go crazy? Are you guys ready? So we have our blades. She loves light. All right, here we have Darth Maul's lightsaber. Are you ready for the dog to go crazy? There you go. Wrong one. You gotta turn those knobs. It's like the worst design ever. And then you gotta make some sort of weird sound. Ugh. Okay, so that's his lightsaber. Alright, then dramatic things happen. Like, Hold on, we're going to spill the tea. <sighs> he dies. <laughs> Was that a little too dramatic for you? So he dies. Um, Obi-Wan Kenobi kills him. Uh, I hope you guys already knew this because it, it happens. If you guys watch the Clone War series, um, he comes back. I was gonna say a bad word there, but then I was like, ah. But he came back. So, and he had a new lightsaber. Now, in like the meantime, he also had a lightsaber that was like this, with like like a hooky thingy on it, or like a, a thing. 
don't know, but uh, we have this. So with this guy, you only need one. So let's put one away because why not? You know, my favorite Star Wars people, comment down below if any of your animals go crazy with your lightsaber. I would like to know. So we have our pieces. This is the, the that one for that one. This one goes in like this box. Put these off to the side. Because we have this one. So, season seven of Clone Wars. Darth Maul come. <gasps> Spoiler alert. Oh, well, who cares? That's what Google's for. Um, so this box has a different emblem than the other boxes do. So let's open it and see why it's different. Ready? Bam! It looks different. You are just extra, Lilo. So, they also did the same thing with all the other lightsabers. Oh. And it's just a plastic thing. Hello. This one comes with instructions. You also have nicely displayed your Allen wrench and your connector. Let me take those out for you. They actually chose to display it somewhere prominent where you can see it instead of hiding down below. So yeah, let's just put that right in front of you. Cause uh, why not? So we have these things. Cause uh, why not? I just feel like that's and this is really cool this is a very cool design that they did remove our don't put your finger in this hole cap put your finger in the hole yeah very cool design um so this one also has just a regular bottom Unscrew it. It's actually very heavy. There's no functions. It's just, hello, I see you. Can you see me? Here is our batteries. Thank you, Disney, for providing us with batteries instead of us having to go and buy them from you. Did I put these upside down? No, it works fine. Um, and then there's little teeth. Can you see? Well, this one doesn't have teeth, this one has holes, but it's got holes. The um, connector it came with has teeth. Marr. So, you gotta connect the pieces. Well, I guess I'll show you the pieces first. Show you the blade. So it's nice, it's really smooth. There goes the battery pack. Like always, it wouldn't be my lightsaber unless I dropped the batteries. So your on and off is a classic Anakin Skywalker blade or button or switchy or schwa schwa. I don't know what you want to call it. I'll just put my finger there because I'm too lazy to put the canister back. Um, you have your mystic holes right there. That that's where the magic happens. Then you got your finger hole. That's where you put your finger. So for this lightsaber, you have to do a little bit of DIY. Um, with the bottom that I removed, you don't have to remove it. You can keep it on, but I removed it so I could make the batteries fall out. Um, Gotta remove the top of it with your Allen wrench. 
And then you can see all of the things that it lines up with, maybe. Ah, figured it out. I don't know, I haven't assembled it yet. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Got it. All right. You put it on the bottom of this one. The natural bottom, and then you twist it back together. Put your little Allen wrench back in there. I should have probably just read the directions, but figure it out. And Disney probably should have made the directions so small. You know. They wanted you to read them. Bam. So there she is. We put the this one. This one. And this one as well with your Allen wrench, you can um, line it up. So you gotta do a little bit of DIY to line it up with all of your things. So I'm mine doesn't line up perfectly out of the box. And with me just jiggy rigging it, so I'm just going to go like that so it lines up movie magically. Ooh, right there, so movie magic. So let me show you this guy. So here we have Darth Maul's Season 7 Clone Wars lightsaber. Super cool. And then inside, I'll only hassle you with one side. Inside, you can see your kyber, kyber crystal glowing. Here you are. It's like hitting my ceiling fan. It's so tall. So there you are. Super cool. So you can just have it. You obviously you're held like this. It works. I've shown you. Or you can have the double mall. Um, super cool customization. Really cool. I really like the the DIYing Disney's getting to like like not not only the build your own lightsaber at both East and West Galaxy's Edge, but like now we're getting into customizing our legacy sabers. So like I can just walk around with this, or I can customize it by adding the mall part. Because if you weren't a Star Wars crazy lady, you wouldn't, I'm pretty sure I can show this to my sister and be like, look, I got a lightsaber. And she'd be like, oh my gosh, that's so cool. I'm like, yeah, she would not know it's Darth Maul or part of Darth Maul's saber. So yeah, pretty cool. Tell me what you think down below. I have every single legacy lightsaber 
up to right now. So let me know if you guys want to see more. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.